What's up everyone and welcome back to Movie Race. Millie Bobby Brown, the star of Stranger Things, is set for an exciting adventure in her upcoming Netflix movie Damsel. This fairy tale takes a fresh spin on the traditional damsel in distress story, promising a mix of fantasy, danger, and Millie's unique charm. The teaser trailer introduces Princess Elod, played by Brown, urgently escaping a menacing creature, challenging the typical princess role. The film explores a perilous cave where Elod faces challenges showcasing her survival instincts against dragons and treacherous obstacles. Sherlock Holmes. The press? The Marquis case. You need to arrest his grandmother, the Dowager. She's trying to kill him, as she killed his father. Damsel aims to be a captivating movie, defying fairy tale norms, and highlighting Millie Bobby Brown's acting versatility. With that being said, you are here for Enola Holmes, so let's talk about it. Enola Holmes is gearing up for a third adventure, and while the earlier movies took creative liberties with the source material, the upcoming Enola Holmes 3 is poised to stay truer to its roots. The series, led by Millie Bobby Brown as the young detective, draws inspiration from Nancy Springer's book series The Enola Holmes Mysteries. In this literary world, Sherlock and Mycroft Holmes have a younger sister named Enola, who embarks on her own detective journey. Netflix's Enola Holmes movies bring Enola's crime-solving escapades beyond the book pages. The first film adapted the initial book, delving into the family drama that shaped Enola into a detective. The sequel, Enola Holmes 2, loosely followed the second book, portraying Enola's collaboration with Sherlock Holmes' Henry Cavill on her most significant case yet. Now, Enola Holmes 3 is anticipated to align more closely with the third book's narrative, promising a storyline that adheres more faithfully to its source material than the previous adaptations. Enola Holmes 3 is expected to draw inspiration from the third book in the Enola Holmes Mysteries series titled The Case of the Bizarre Bouquets. While the previous movies took liberties in the source material, the upcoming film has the opportunity to stay more faithful to the book thanks to developments in Enola Holmes 2. In the second movie, Enola, concerned about her older brother Sherlock, sent him a potential friend and flatmate. Despite the siblings realizing they don't need to be alone, Enola declined Sherlock's partnership offer and arranged to meet him later. However, in a mid credit scene, a man, Himesh Patel, arrived at Baker Street looking for Sherlock, revealing that Enola had recommended him as a flatmate. This man turns out to be Dr. John Watson, establishing the iconic Sherlock-John duo. The case of the Bizarre Bouquets focuses on Dr. Watson's mysterious disappearance. Enola, equipped with her extensive knowledge of flowers, investigates the case after finding a bouquet intended for Watson. The floral symbolism leads her to a mental institution, where Watson is believed to be mentally unstable. Enola must unravel the mystery, questioning whether Watson is truly insane or if someone is plotting against him. With John Watson introduced into the Enola Holmes film universe, the third movie has the potential to closely follow the book's engaging storyline. Enola Holmes 3 has introduced a significant change to the plot, departing from a key element in the third book, The Case of the Bizarre Bouquets. The alteration stems from events in Enola Holmes 2, prompting a shift in Enola's storyline. In both the first movie and the corresponding book, Enola flees to London in search of her missing mother, Eudoria, and to evade her brother's plans to send her to boarding school. To escape her detective brother, Sherlock, Enola disguises herself and establishes her own agency, a plotline mirrored in Enola Holmes 2. However, in the books, she adopts the persona of Ivy Meschel, the nondescript assistant to an imaginary employer to remain hidden from Sherlock. Enola Holmes 3 deviates from this setup as the young detective is no longer concealing herself in London, having already teamed up with her brother in the previous film. In the book's arc, Enola keeps her location and identity secret from Sherlock, communicating with him through newspaper posts. The film's alteration simplifies Enola's movements in the city as she searches for Watson, without the concern of Sherlock and potentially Mycroft discovering her whereabouts and activities. Enola Holmes 3 has the perfect opportunity to showcase a seamless team-up between Enola and Sherlock Holmes, given the disappearance of Dr. Watson. 
This natural connection provides a smoother transition for the home's siblings to collaborate on solving the mystery. In Enola Homes 2, the siblings' partnership emerged as their individual cases converged, leading them to work together. With Watson's disappearance in Enola Homes 3, the home siblings can team up again in a more organic manner. Enola having sent Watson to Sherlock is already linked to both characters. This sets the stage for the ultimate home siblings team up with Mycroft's minimal presence, much to Enola's potential relief. However, there is a potential risk of Enola Holmes 3 focusing too much on a Sherlock Holmes narrative at the expense of Enola's own story. The charm of the previous movies lay in witnessing the younger Holmes sister establish herself as a detective. While the Holmes siblings' collaboration worked in the second film, Enola Holmes 3 must carefully balance their teamwork, ensuring that Enola remains the central protagonist rather than being overshadowed by Sherlock's presence. With that being said, while you are here, let me fill you in on the story that Damsel will follow. The story follows Princess Elod, who agrees to marry a prince but takes an unexpected turn when she becomes a target in a nefarious plot. The royal family, led by Queen Isabel, Robin Wright, and Prince Henry, Nick Robinson, recruits her for a sacrificial debt repayment. Elod must navigate a cave with a fire-breathing dragon, relying on her wit and determination to survive. The teaser hints at a dark history of previous princesses facing similar fates, adding layers to the story's intensity. Damsel promises a thrilling adventure with a grounded survival experience and a fantastical edge. Brown is praised as the heart of the film, drawing audiences into the dark and intense adventure. The movie is expected to be released in 2024, offering a unique take on the classic princess and dragon narrative. Despite her young age, Millie Bobby Brown has strategically navigated her career, transitioning from a child actor to a formidable force in the industry. Her success includes turning the Enola Holmes books into a franchise, executive producing and starring in Damsel, and securing rights to projects. Brown's strategic approach, showcased during Netflix's Geeky Week, reinforces her status as a powerhouse in the entertainment industry. Damsel subverts the damsel in distress trope by actively involving its protagonist, Elod, in her survival. The teaser highlights her evolution from a proper royal to a self-rescuing princess, symbolizing empowerment. The supporting cast, including Robin Wright and Nick Robinson, adds depth to the narrative. Director Juan Carlos Fresnadillo's vision blends fantasy with grounded realism, promising an immersive cinematic experience that challenges genre conventions. With that being said, there is one major thing we have to tell you. The Duffer brothers initiated excitement by sharing a picture of a whiteboard with Stranger Things Season 5 written on it, marking the start of the new and final season. Yet a subsequent post detailing the planning for Season 5 on the whiteboard left some fans disappointed. The grid stage revealed a lesser number of episodes compared to the previous season, sparking discontent among fans who expected more. Additionally, the Eddie Munson theory has surfaced, suggesting the return of a character believed to have met his demise in Season 4. The theory speculates that given the transformative nature of the Upside Down, Munson may have survived and turned into a vampire. The presence of bad tattoos on Munson's arms in the show adds an intriguing layer to the theory. Despite uncertainties about the plot of Season 5, the Duffer brothers have assured fans that the conclusion has been firmly mapped out. The focus will shift to Will Byers, emphasizing his coming-of-age journey and exploring character arcs, including the resolution of relationships. Described as an intense and emotional roller coaster, Season 5 is expected to captivate audiences from the opening scene to the climactic finale. And that's that for today's video. Thanks for watching, and we will see you in the next one. Your suggestions for future videos are always welcome in the comments below.